Hi, I'm Corinne with Thompson RV in Pendleton, Oregon. Today I'm going to show you a brand new 2022 Backcountry 28 DBS bunk bed model. So this is in the Backcountry series built by Outdoors RV. It's a standalone series consisting of only four floor plans. Every single one of these four floor plans is built on an 8 inch I-beam chassis, has the full wraparound front cap, a built-in Onan propane generator, 170 watt roof mounted solar already comes standard on it, 100 gallons of water, and a few other features that are found only on the Backcountry series to make it the most off-grid vehicle you can get from Outdoors RV. So on the creek side, the Timber Ridge, the Blackstone, the Glacier Peak, any other models, you can add solar panels, you can add extra batteries, you can do a lot of things to make them more off-grid, but with the addition of the generator and the additional water, that's what's gonna set this one apart from the others. So they make one bunk bed floor plan in the Backcountry series, and it's the 28 DBS. So that's the one today that we're gonna to tour through the inside. We'll see what it looks like with the slide out in, and then we'll also go around the outside and show you where everything is on the outside. So here we are, if we come in the front door, you've got ample counter space, lots of overhead cabinetry, a flip up counter extension. You've got the single basin farm style sink, with the wire rack in the bottom and the high arc faucet. You're gonna notice that the trim level in a backcountry series is almost identical to the mountain series on the other models. Right here, when you walk in, you've got your 12 volt Jensen flat screen TV, your stereo that has CD, DVD, as well as Bluetooth, a large cabinet. A lot of people are gonna put their DVDs and books and things there. And then this open space right here, that's where you would kick your shoes off when you walk in the door so you're not tripping over all of your kids' shoes. Over here, this one is equipped with the sleeper sofa, but we option in theater seating quite often. You also get the Outdoors RV large mountain dinette. This also will make into a bed for extra sleeping. In the Backcountry series, they are gonna give you the slow rise blackout shades in just the living area. Pot and pan drawer on each side of the dinette. And this has the new locking mechanism, so it can't fly open when going down the road. And there's a little extra storage on each side of this uh, dinette. You have to just take the cushions off to access that. So you're gonna wanna put stuff there that's not as important to get to on a daily basis. Over here at the bunk beds, you've got some storage here for your kids' items, books, um, extra clothing, whatever. On each bunk bed, they come with the teddy bear bunk mattress. They have a little storage area for other items such as books, a USB port, and an overhead light. So both bunks are gonna have that. Over here is going to be your wardrobe for either extra clothes of yours or for your children or your hunting buddies or whoever it is you're taking in your bunk bed model with you. The Norcold eight cubic foot refrigerator with the cold weather package. You get a 12 volt outlet and a USB port right here in the kitchen as well. And then as far as outlets in the kitchen, you've got a 110 outlet here as well as by the sink. And then for pantry storage, because you get this extra chunk of counter space, you're getting a very deep cabinet there and then good ample overhead storage as well. Now moving into the bedroom. So this has actually a full walk around bed with two pocket doors to make this more of a private bedroom. Emergency exit window right behind me. And then you also have the gun safe that goes next to the bed. You can use that for any valuables. Um, it just has a little code on it to access whatever it is that you put in there. You've got a shirt ward on each side, overhead cabinetry that passes all the way through. And then because these are equipped with solar, you're gonna have your ZAMP charge controller right there above the bed. Again, it comes standard with 170 watt panel on the roof, but you can add up to two more for a total of three. We like to equip all of ours with the Max Air Deluxe vent fan. So this is the remote that runs the overhead fan. So it's thermostatically controlled. You can set it to a certain temperature and if it gets cold during the night, it will automatically shut off. It has a built-in rain hood, so you can run it in the rain, you can run it going down the road. It also will do intake or exhaust. 
and it's a 10 speed fan. So these are a must. We order them on every unit that we, that we have. Let's take a peek at the bathroom and then we'll shut the slide out and show you what it looks like and what you can access with the slide out in. So here in the bathroom, another max air fan, an air conditioner duct, skylight over the shower, the wood medicine cabinet, a couple of towel hooks, you get the second entry door into the bathroom, which is really cool. We call that a mudroom door. That way people don't have to traipse through the whole trailer to go to the restroom. Porcelain toilet, heated floor register, stainless steel sink. And then you also get the knuckled shower curtain, which is very cool. So when you aren't using the shower, you can knuckle it in and hang wet towels or swimsuits over to drip into the tub. When you're in the shower, you can have more space by knuckling it out and away from your body. Right here by the door, you've got all of your switches for your water pump, water heater, all of that kind of stuff. We include the 12 volt heat pad on the fresh water tank on all of our units. So let's go ahead and put this slide out in and see what it looks like. So as you can see with the slide out in, this one you can easily access everything. All of your counter space, your oven, your refrigerator, and even the bathroom door opens all the way. Of course, you could always jump in through the back door to go to the restroom, but you can access everything uh, just with one, one door. All right, it seems fitting on the Backcountry Series to start the exterior walkthrough on the outside by the Onan 3600 generator. So this is run off of the LP tanks. On the Backcountry Series, you're gonna get bigger 10 gallon propane tanks. And to start this up, Right in there where I just showed you the switches, there's a switch for the generator. You just push that button, fires up the generator. You can run your air conditioner. You can run a blow dryer, coffee pot, microwave, whatever it is you're wanting to run off of 110, just even to charge the batteries if for some reason you need to. You just push that button and this generator will start up. One thing that isn't an option from the factory, but we do a lot of here once the mountain series or the backcountry series gets to our lot, is the slide out topper like you would find on a titanium series. That's a really good add to keep all the debris off of the top of your slide out. To dump your fresh water on this particular model, the slide out is gonna need to be in, or I mean, I guess you could crawl under there, but it's easier if the slide out is in. Your fresh water valve handle is right between the two axles and that's 100 gallons of fresh water. So if you don't use it all on your trip, we do recommend that you just drain it out and get all the water out. Back here towards the rear, you're gonna have your dump valves for your gray and your black water, as well as a light. Because this is a bunk bed model, you actually get an access door here. The bunk bed folds up and you have a rubberized diamond plate um, storage area. One cool thing that we just did on um, another customer's unit was we added a 12 volt outlet in here and they got one of those 12 volt, um, it looks like a chest cooler, but it's actually a refrigerator freezer and they were gonna keep it in here, which is a really cool idea. So we sell the ones that are made by Dometic and they're very, very high quality compressor style, style 12 volt fridges. Here on the back, you're gonna get the large tube ladder cable and satellite hookups, 30 amp service, which twist locks right here. This is gonna be your black tank flush. It says Santee flush on it, not to be confused with your city water inlet. Here is the spray port and the power switch for instead of an outside shower, they're gonna give you a hose with its own uh, separate pump. Two inch receiver hitch, we option that on all of our units and it's good up to 250 pounds. Spare tire. We've optioned power stabilizer jacks onto all of our backcountry series. It is optional to get the manual crank down jacks instead. Right here, you're gonna have your rear entry door. Again, that's what we call that mudroom door that gets you right into the bathroom. As you can see, you get a very long awning on this and it is wrapped with the Illumigard, just like they do on all Outdoors RV models. Exterior speakers that are gonna run off of your Bluetooth stereo in the inside of the coach. This is just a refrigerator vent, access and venting for your furnace. This is where you would fill your 100 gallon fresh water tank. 110 outlets. 
And then sometimes I fail to mention all of the amazing standard features that come on an outdoors RV. I'm so busy telling you about the floor plan, I assume that everybody knows, but the, the Backcountry Series, as well as many of the other models, come equipped with the 16-inch Goodyear Load Range E tires, heavy-duty axles, and the Off-Red X4 suspension package. So that's gonna be your More Ride CRE 3000 suspension, KYB off-road shocks, as well as heavy-duty shackles with greasable zerts, on all of the Outdoors RV models, you're also going to get the fully enclosed and heated uh, underbelly. So all of the tanks are enclosed and heated. We add the additional 12 volt heat pad onto the fresh water tank. But these, we've had people get these down to negative five degrees and not freeze up. So these are a very, very cold weather package. Dual pane windows come standard on everything. So a lot of places will tell you, or a lot of companies will tell you that they're a Four Seasons trailer. They're not, they're two, maybe three at best. These are a true Four Seasons package. Two inch thick sidewalls, one inch thick insulated uh, luggage compartment doors, an insulated outside shower door. So they do a lot of things above and beyond on top of their insulation in their ceiling, their floors, all of that to make them a true off-grid Four Seasons trailer. You get an exterior grab bar handle right here, triple aluminum step, 10 gallon rapid recovery water heater. This is your front storage compartment. And because this one doesn't go all the way through, since there's a generator on the other side, they're giving you the more ride sliding tray. That way you can access things that are in the, towards the middle. You also have an ax holder, shovel holder. You can use these for fly fishing rods, whatever you want. Rubberized diamond plate flooring. And then all of this is also insulated so you don't have any cold air coming from your compartment up to your bed. Right in here, you're gonna have the switches to your power jacks, as well as your battery kill switch, and then a compartment light switch. In addition to the roof mount solar panels, you can also do a portable ZAMP solar connected right to this solar port here, and that's good for up to 200 watts of solar. This is a full fiberglass front cap, which wraps over the edges of the trailer to help get rid of any kind of water intrusion. So you don't have a seam right here on the corner. It also, if you've ever seen a used trailer with a wavy front, that's called delamination. There's no way this hard fiberglass front is ever gonna do that. It's one solid hard piece of fiberglass. The toy lock feature, that comes with the rear receiver hitch package. Four battery rack comes standard on the Backcountry series. So we can do four six volt AGMs is a very popular option. Uh, some people do three of the Battleborn lithiums. 10 gallon propane tanks, front power jack, and then also the handy little caddy that stores your seven way cable, safety chains and breakaway cable. So they're not just laying on the ground. And that is the 2022 Backcountry 28 DBS. We appreciate you guys watching all of our videos. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to us. Uh, we can help you with any questions you might have about product availability, pricing, and all of that sort of thing. So feel free to call us at 541-276-4836.